Well, are you one of the 100 million people suffering right now from chronic pain, or are you someone, or do you know someone suffering from major depression, another very common disability? If so, there's a new book out that could help get to the bottom of what's causing your problems. It's called Total Recovery, and it's by Dr. Gary Kaplan, who joins us this morning. Good morning, Dr. Kaplan. Good morning, Barbara. Now, you say this is a whole new way of, of looking at these illnesses, both pain and depression. It is. We've been thinking of these as diseases, and in fact, they're symptoms. They're symptoms of a brain on fire. They're symptoms of a brain inflamed. And because of that, we've been treating the symptoms so long, we get very poor results. If we start treating the cause, the thing that set off the inflammation, we have a chance of total recovery. We've been hearing a lot about inflammation these days. People uh, think that they, uh, they're they changing their diets, they aren't drinking milk, many aren't eating uh, cereals and nuts and all kinds of things because it's causing inflammation. Is this the same kind of thing? It's similar. The things that cause inflammation in the brain are a little bit different than the things that cause inflammation in the rest of the body. So inflammation comes in a lot of forms. So if you have allergies, for instance, your nose is running and your eyes are itching, that's because of histamine release. And you treat that with an antihistamine. But if you're going to treat inflammation in the brain, you have to look at the things that cause inflammation. And these are the results of accumulated events in people's lives. Now, you say that pain and uh, depression are actually related in some way. Very much so. We see common centers in the brain with, that are affected by both of these diseases. We see dysregulation of the way the brain integrates itself and works with both these diseases. As we show viewers some conditions that uh, are caused by chronic pain, tell us how pain can be treated in the same way as uh, depression is treated. And these are some of the things you say, uh, fibromyalgia, a neuropathic pain? So these are actually symptoms, again, of a brain on fire, brain inflamed. So fibromyalgia is a generalized pain syndrome throughout the body. These people really suffer and struggle with day-to-day -day pain that can be fairly incapacitating. Neuropathic pain is more related to damage to specific nerves. The chronic daily headaches or migraines, we had one woman that we treated, it turned out that the cause of her migraines and panic attacks, by the way, which were fairly incapacitating, was gluten intolerance. And so by taking her off gluten and repairing some of the damage that had been done to the intestines from that, her panic attack stopped and the headache stopped. So a whole new way of looking at things. The book is called Total Recovery, and folks can find out about uh, ways to, to perhaps be treated for things that they didn't know could be and treated. And get results where we were unable to get them before. All right, Dr. Kaplan, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you thank for having you. me.